The way the Rio Grande Zoo disposed of the body of a beloved giraffe not only broke the law, it left the mayor outraged when we told him about it. A zoo staff member tossed the giraffe's dismembered body into a dumpster, which ended up in the landfill. A warning, some of the details in this story are disturbing and some of the images are graphic. Here is News 13's Ian Schwartz. You may be surprised or even shocked to hear this, but zoo animals do go to the landfill when they die. But the way the zoo staff handled Kashka could mean big trouble as the city has now opened an investigation. And again, another warning, some of the content in this story is graphic. This is Kashka, the draft who called Albuquerque's Rio Grande Zoo home for more than 15 years. She had six calves here and was a zoo favorite. I like them because they like, because they like eating and they like um, drinking. But last week, the zoo had to euthanize Kashka after a leg injury left her unable to stand. In a press release, the biopark said zookeepers and staff will sincerely miss Kashka. So how did zoo staff dispose of a beloved draft that will be missed by so many? Well, she was stuffed in a plastic bag and thrown into a dumpster on the zoo's property and left for the garbage man to pick up. These are photos of what's left of Kashka, pictures so graphic we have to blur a lot of them out. She was dumped in the landfill with other zoo trash. It is totally inappropriate and something that should outrage everyone. Betty Rivera with the city of Albuquerque oversees the Rio Grande Zoo. She says Kashka was dismembered so the vet could perform a necropsy, a standard practice. At that point when uh, the vet was complete, the uh, director of the zoo then instructed one of the persons at the zoo to please take the remains to the landfill. But instead of taking the draft to the area designated for dead animals in the landfill, a zoo worker against the rules put the giraffe carcass in a dumpster on site. Rivera says this is not how loved zoo animals should be treated, and the mayor's office has started a full investigation into what went wrong. I know that our people in our department are very saddened and really upset about what occurred. And I think you can understand why. It should never have happened. Now, dead animals can be taken to the landfill, but it is against city laws to leave them in a trash can or a dumpster for a garbage truck to pick up. Back to you. Well, thank you, Ian. Mayor R.J. Berry wants the investigation finished by Friday. He says he wants to find out who is responsible for this, and he'll take appropriate action. The man accused.